Hey, what's up everybody? Matt Montgomery here. Today I want to talk to you about what is a sales funnel. Now, maybe you've seen them around, maybe you've done some research, maybe you've watched other videos, but I know when I first got started and I kept hearing this word sales funnel, sales funnel, sales funnel, it was really confusing to me and I didn't know how to build one, I didn't know what they were, and I was just very unclear on the whole subject. So what I like to do is I like to always take everything that I've learned and I like to put it on the whiteboard, kind of draw it out and just simplify everything for, um, for myself. So um, this is my process for me to basically draw out what a sales funnel is. I want to show you and, and walk you through the basic steps because I, I truly believe once you understand how simple it is, you'll go, oh, well that doesn't sound um, hard at all, right? So the number one thing you need to understand, what is a sales funnel? A sales funnel is nothing but a sales process done on the internet, okay? So think back, how many times have you gone out for um, somewhere and come home and have seen those little annoying door hangers hanging on your door from your local pizza or Chinese restaurant, right? And they're going around flyering every single door in the neighborhood or the apartment complex that you live in, trying and hoping that somebody's going to call that number and order off of the menu that was stapled to the back of that door hanger. Okay, that is their essence and their way of doing a sales process. They're hoping somebody will call, and once they, once once you call, they're gonna you know upsell you or try to get you to buy something else or maybe get you to come in the restaurant, you know whatever it may be. Or you know another sales thing is what if a pest control guy comes by and he knocks on your door and and you go, can I help you? And he goes, yeah, we're um, we're so and so X Y Z pest control company. We're doing um. Harold Jones down the street and we're spraying his yard and right now we're offering a great discount rate to do your yard and your eaves and all this stuff and it's usually this price but today's going to be this price can we come by at this time today and does that work for you well that person you know first of all introduced himself told them who they were then he took them through what they were doing which is they're a pest control company. You own a home, you're a homeowner, so you're like, oh yeah, well bugs and pests is, is a thing that we deal with. So in your mind, you're like, well this is something I'm interested in. And then he says, hey, we can give you a great quality discount and at this time, can we get a commitment from you? That was a very quick offline sales process, okay? And online it's done a lot differently, okay? So let me demonstrate for you, right? So let's just use Facebook advertising. For an example, is where we would get our uh, our traffic, right? Traffic is people that we're advertising to. Somebody that sees an ad, clicks on the ad, and then is brought over to this page. Okay, this page would be what that offline person is. The page would be, hey, I knock on your door, you answer the door. Now, me, the salesman, is now speaking to you, the consumer. But this is how it's done online. Okay, so we have Facebook ad. See that? Yeah. And then you got the arrow, and then we have what we call a landing page. Okay? Now the landing page is what the person is going to land on once they come from the Facebook ad. Alright, so whatever the Facebook ad said, you, you gave a headline, what it doesn't matter whatever you're selling, right? So in, you know, let's say we're in the make money online niche, we're we're offering some way to help some individual start start a business making money online. They come to the landing page. Now, online, this is what we do here. We offer them something for free and of high value to get their email address, okay? So right here, you're going to say something like, hey, get my free mini course today on how to make $10,000 in the next six months or how to make $10,000 in the next 30 days, make it sexy or something like that. The whole point of this page is to get that person's email address and push them through to the next process in the sales funnel, okay? So, <clears throat> we got gift, <coughs> then we got, we want email, and once they give us their email, they go over here to the next step in the sales funnel. Now, <clears throat> this next step in the sales funnel would be your offer whether it's your own offer or an affiliate offer, okay? But this is where you would send them. Actually, I'm sorry, back up. I missed, I missed a crucial, crucial, absolutely crucial step. If you're an affiliate marketer, 
you are not going to send them, once you get their email address, directly to your affiliate offer. You are going to send them to what you call a bridge page, and that is what this is going to be. Okay, so this is your bridge page. Now, the purpose of that is, this person that came from Facebook and gave you their email, you got their attention, you hooked them here, you hooked them with the gift, the free gift, you gave them value to get their email address, now they come over here and they have no idea who you are, okay? They have no idea why they should buy whatever you're selling. This right here is where you have the opportunity if I was to sit down at dinner with you and have a conversation, or if we were sitting on an airplane together having a conversation, getting to know one another, that's what this page is. Because once you get to know me and I get to know you, if I recommended, hey, when we land in Atlanta today, if you went and checked out this really cool brewery, because last time I was here, it was stellar and they had this awesome beer and you found out that that person liked beer, they're a lot more likely to go try that brewery out because of your recommendation, because they got to know you. Now, if you didn't know me from Adam, and I just said, hey, 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 cool guy, and start screaming in your face and say, go check out this awesome brewery, they got great beer. And that person may be allergic to beer. You know what I'm saying? So this is where you are able to tell your story, get, get to know that individual. I won't go into it too in depth today. I'm just laying out the framework of a sales funnel, okay? <coughs> Excuse me. So we got our Facebook ad. We got our, op, our, our lead page, we got their email. For affiliates only, you got your bridge page, okay? You're gonna typically do a video here on this page. You got your little video inside. You're gonna have some boxes underneath, all right? This is how I would build a bridge page for me, real simple, okay? I'd have a video, and I would make the video talking about the offer that I'm promoting, whatever that is, okay? Let's say you're gonna promote ClickFunnels. I would talk about how ClickFunnels has changed my life. How before ClickFunnels I was struggling, how before ClickFunnels I couldn't ever get the tech stuff figured out or it was costing me a lot of money to put together or something in, the, in, in this process and you paid it, right? This is what changed my life. ClickFunnels is what changed my life. I tell that story. Now, the really cool key to this and how you sell a crap ton of other people's products during this whole thing is you take this page, your affiliate offer is here. This is your affiliate offer right there. Okay, I'm sorry for my handwriting being crap. This is your affiliate offer. Now, <coughs> whatever this page looks like, the next page that they go to, you want to kind of model your bridge page after the affiliate offer so you don't confuse the individual. You want to make sure everything stays simultaneously, simultaneously, I can't say the word, similar, okay? You want your, you want your ad, when they go from your ad to your landing page to kind of be similar to the ad so they know they clicked on the right place. <clears throat> when they go from your landing page to your bridge page, you want it to be similar so they're not confused and click off. When they go from your bridge page to your uh, affiliate offer, <clears throat> you want it to be similar so they stay the course. In sales, you never want to confuse an individual because once you confuse them and they start thinking subconsciously <clears throat> that this person is trying to scam me <clears throat> or whatever it is, they're going to leave and you lost the sale, okay? Um, so here, you got your bridge page, you got your video telling them about the opportunity and why you chose it, why it's great. Here's a cool trick. <clears throat> this is how you win in the affiliate game. You're going to offer them additional bonuses. You're going to offer them additional bonuses. Now, how I would do this if I was promoting ClickFunnels is over here on ClickFunnels, page, there's going to be bonuses when you purchase ClickFunnels. I would take those bonuses and I would put them underneath the video. And I would say, this is what you're going to get from Russell Brunson when you purchase ClickFunnels today. And I would list them, one, two, three, whatever they are. And I'd list the, the bonus offers. Well, then this is what we call value stacking. This is what you call a value ladder. You're leading this person through, you, they're getting to know you, but then boom, you're hitting them with so much value that they would be crazy to leave and not purchase through your affiliate link. And then you would say, but wait, there's more. When you get this today <clears throat> to my affiliate link, I'm also going to give you bonus one, bonus two, bonus three, bonus four. 
and you're gonna and you're gonna give them your bonuses. Now, how do you make bonuses? I'll make another video on that, and I'll post the link in the description below, talking all about how to make bonuses and creating an offer around your affiliate um, pay your affiliate offers. Okay, you want to create offers on top of the affiliate offer to stand out in the crowd and to make yourself super valuable. You do this correctly, you will make money. People will follow you and people will buy from you, okay? So this is essential, this is a sales funnel. <clears throat> if you like this video, sorry, <coughs> the cold. If you like this video, comment, subscribe please to the channel, give me a thumbs up, and uh, let me know what you think about this. If you want more content like this, I'll dive in deeper. Thanks for watching. Talk to you soon.